All right guys, what's going on? So finally, I'm starting the workshop build that I've been trying to do for ages now. Those of you that follow my channel know that I've just been building random electric bikes and YouTube-based stuff in my lounge, on my driveway when the weather's good, and during the winter it sucks. Finally, the guys are coming in today to make use of this pretty damn big space I've got in my back garden that's just completely wasted. The guys coming in today just doing a base. They're gonna be leveling the ground today and then they're gonna come back on the second day with the shutter in and the concrete pour. Half the slabs have come up and probably a million other things as well. Yeah, most of the stuff's come up now. There was a bunch of paving slabs. The guys have used like a laser level to start leveling it off to get a basic level and a little rotavator over there. And it's coming along nice. It's looking a lot flatter. It looks so much bigger now that you've actually like leveled it flat. It looks like double the size. I don't know if this is coming out on camera, that's quite a flipping substantial shed pace. Yeah. <laughs> that's, that's what, four and a half metres deep from the wall where you're measuring now? That's a decent size, I'm happy with that. Literally only taken my dog for a two and a half mile walk and I've come back and the shutter in's completely finished and they've run. And you've got this huge, huge concrete pumping hose and pump set up waiting for the concrete lorry to turn up. Wicked, nice one, mate. You too, mate. No well worries. Done. Nicely in one day. So yeah. that's it then. Yeah. Yeah, you'll be able to walk on that tomorrow. Tomorrow, yeah. 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 Just got to keep the foxes yeah, off for them tonight. To be fair, the strength of the concrete you've got there, a couple of hours, they'll be able to walk on it and won't leave an impression in it anyway. So, yeah, have you got a link or anything? If you got a Facebook uh, I've page, got, um, I've got a Facebook page, um, base for you. Um, I really only advertise on Facebook to be fair. It's fine, I'll put, the, I'll put the link in the description if anyone's interested. I mean, this was in and out in one day, no problem, yeah. really. Yeah, a bit, no, little fine. bit of levelling work yeah. before you come in. Yeah, pretty pretty easy and straightforward, guys. And if you haven't got access like me, I've got no side access at all to, to get any kind of machine or anything through. Like, getting this pumped through is so much easier, isn't it? I mean, oh, yeah. how much time yeah. and work's it going to save? Wheelbarrowing and that, there's not, not a lot of wheelbarrowing you know, anymore. A little bit of mess, not too much. Like, yeah. nothing's really left behind, but compared to, like, mixing stuff up on, you know, at, at the location, it's way better. So I do recommend it. Yeah. And, yeah, thanks a lot, mate. No worries. No All right, worries. nice one. Right, Cheers. We'll pack up. Yeah, I'll finish up the... Uh... Oh, mate. Right, that's it then, guys. Looks pretty, pretty decent. I'm super excited for this to go off. 
and start planning on where I'm going to source a shed stroke workshop. Hopefully I can get something about the size of this base, like close to eight meters by four meters would be absolutely amazing. And I can crack on with my e-bike videos through the winter, so that will be amazing. So anyway, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the video soon. Thank you.